All right, y'all, off to the weekly toy hunt. Just got my haircut, but they ain't got no gel or nothing up in there, so this is what I got. Um, but anyway, we do toy hunt. It's Mother's Day weekend. Happy Mother's Day to all you moms out there um, uh, keeping it, you know, keeping the household going and everything else. Happy Mother's Day. Uh, it's hard to be a mom nowadays, especially when you got to work too and everything else. Just men just need to step up, man. You just have to. Uh, but anyway, um, we are off to our weekly toy hunt. Let's see what they got. We are at Walmart Tracy, California. Um, and I'm not going to be out and about so much because I'm getting ready for Sinister Creature Con. And I've bought some mean, like, major, um, like, masks to have signed there. So I'm waiting for them in the mail. And they were very costly. So as far as spending, spending, uh, I'm going to try and keep my funds where they need to be and not spend as much. But let's head into Walmart. All right, so let's kick it off with some models. Oh, geez. Yeah, I'm at that Walmart, the one that always has some cool models. But, yeah, look at that one. Yeah, my grandfather had a car like that back in the day that <laughs> went up top. You can see these. These are really cool. I got a feeling this is going to be a thing again. I love the artwork of it, too. You could just buy these just for the artwork. Look at this. Just so cool. The 57 Thunderbird, which just looks real nice. So let's take a look at some Pokemon. Yeah, they got Pokemon going on. A lot of new new Pokemon here. So just not the cards are cool. You know, the toys are amazing. So look at this dude. Looks like he's had a bad day. You know, probably shit the bed and don't know what to do now. Mom, can you please help me? Um, but anyway, here you go. What the hell? Look at this. All these different variants of this thing. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. We got these. We got this dude, Bendy, right here. Looking real cool. And what in the world are these? Never seen these before, but... Yeah, they're... It's gonna be a thing. Okay. So here goes some new Sonic. We got no problem. Right here. All right. So you got these right here. This little monkey guy. Looks real cool. Look at that. Some more Super Mario. And then Sonic also has that four pack down there, which looks real cool. All right, so I don't know specifically what these are, but they go to that. So they got this. Uh-oh. I'm going to have to pick that up. Yeah. And then for Masters of the Universe, I do like that Tila. Um, it's very cool. I was collecting them for a while, the Origins ones. And the Skeletor is pretty cool, too. But I was collecting for a while and then I just stopped. I don't know what happened. All right, so wrestling's looking a little dry over here. Not really much. Um, you got Piper. Ready? Let's say Captain Lou. Vader. Captain Lou. Yeah, it's a little dried up. Not really much going on here. So it looks like they have two of that rock. Um, three pack and yes I did get a chance to see Peter Maivia um, wrestle back in his day and I've even met him uh, over at the Cow Palace in San, in San Francisco he used to be there all the time every time they came to town big time wrestling he was always on it yeah I'm gonna tell you one of the nicest people you will ever meet was that man right there yeah hands down I might even have his autograph on an old program somewhere um, yeah, they were just so freaking cool. Um, them and he used to always be with like a guy named Dean Ho. There was a guy named Dean Ho back then. And a few other ones. Pat Patterson, Ray Stevens, the old big time wrestling. Yeah, hell of a guy right there for sure. So you got some of these. Yeah, a lot of black series. I really love this Mando. I think it's so freaking cool. But their prices just keep going up. But it has that dart saber and that thing is just so freaking kick-ass. Really nice. 
So like I said before, yeah, if these were down to six bucks, like five ninety nine, there would be none of these here. And Hasbro would be shipping the store more, just cases of these. Um, they need to really think about that if they want to stop laying people off and verse put amount put like large amounts out that are actually going to sell at a good price where people don't have to think about it and they're going to army build with these you know five five six bucks could you imagine you'll sell a whole case of these in one one star wars collector so it's something to really think about i think that they need to think about make um yeah make a big large amounts of quantities the way that it used to be bunch of different characters at a really really good price i think six bucks would have been perfect for these uh people would have jumped all over them if you agree with me um leave it in the comments down below or just dm me through my instagram mo's choice so as far as marvel yeah this is what they got they don't really have any legends here anything other than that but they are next to the jurassic world they move these so I don't know if they're getting ready to do a reset or what's going on with that, but a lot of new stuff here. Yeah, just looking around. Look at these little plushy guys. Uh, yeah, a lot of new stuff. Look at this. We got some new eggs. They even got this. Wow, look at that. It's nice. And they still have the hand puppet, which is really cool. So here goes some Marvel guys. They do have Thor up there. Yeah, looks like it's all Iron Man. That's pretty much about it. And then for the turtles, they got a lot of these old ones. That's the first time seeing this guy. Never seen him. So, yeah, they, look at that big old frog. He looks cool. Yeah, just a lot of things. All right. There you go. So they even have the party wagon. The bigger ones on the bottom. Is this not the coolest three pack you've ever seen? <laughs> Look at this thing. This looks so cool. I remember that movie Zootopia. My kids loved it. So yeah, you got that for Godzilla X Kong, which is. Coming out available, folks. Godzilla X Kong is going to be on Voodoo. Comes out this week in about three days. So, two or three days. So, I don't know when this video is going to air, but it will be out. And now that it's going to be there like that, no longer in theaters, it probably still is in some theaters, you're going to see all that cleaned out. Kids are just going to be buying them the moment that they have access at home to watch it. And then you got all these minis right here that are $4.97 for Legos. You got to collect them all. Don't know who's on there, who's what. Yeah, it's just a blind bag. So you got to do them like that. You could get one of those characters. Really cool. All right, so here goes some Legos. Like I said, they have behind glass, but it's getting to be like that everywhere in California. Every person you see that does toy hunting is seeing that they're behind glass because of the laws that we have here and it's smart it's just smart business folks um there you go it's better than just having like a pull tag or something you gotta pay for it and then go get it but i see that one coming in the future too all right so they got a hell of a star wars area here Look at that, that's cool. I don't know if I, I think that's the back of a box. I was like, man, I've never seen that. So, that destroyer droid's still here, three of them. So, they're no match for a droid that costs. Remember that one, dude? If anyone knows the name of that person, leave it in the comments down below. The one that says that about the Jedi and the Phantom Menace. When Obi-Wan and Qui-Gon go there to negotiate for Padme. Okay. You see that? So they still do carry Ninjago. Still a thing. So that's what they got here for Ninjago. And then you gotta place it down there. And then this is big. This is getting bigger and bigger. Household things that you would see for 
Lego collectors and to take the place of all the fake plants that you have so yeah this and it looks really cool when it's displayed right it really does so for Pokemon this is what they got for the Mega Connects Mega Connects is throwing their hand in the race that is a cool set so is that one down there Ooh, that's new look at that right there so I found an end cap on the where in the very back where the Legos are at. Look at what they got. All the brand new like Super Mario stuff. They just got it like sitting here. New stuff. Luigi. So, yeah, you could look through here all day. Alright, so I found one of these. These are just brand new strawberry shortcakes. And I wonder if they smell like strawberries. That's the question. Um, yeah, there it is, folks. They got them here. And they are going to be in the girls' aisles. Amongst with the Oh My God figures and all the other ones. And all the princesses. And that's where they're going to be. At the very top shelf. And these are the brand new Harry Potter dolls that they brought out. You can see right there. There is the star of the show, Harry. Amongst all everyone else all right so we got some monster high yeah they're getting ready just to drop some new stuff and you just see it coming um yeah like i said it's a matter of time before they do some crossovers with nightmare on elm street and halloween and uh texas chainsaw massacre i don't know if they'll go that extreme right there but could you imagine seeing like a it like one of them dressed up as pennywise or as a uh, Jason Voorhees That would be really cool because they got an Elvira one out there that is just impossible to find All right, so here's a new look for matchbox. I've never seen them look like this. This looks really cool like the way that it looks Compared to that maybe matchbox is gonna start loading their areas up. I don't know to be able to compete with um, Hot Wheels, but you could yeah, they're very picked through over here. These are the Star Wars ones. These look really cool. So, you see some of those. But here's what they got for Hot Wheels. Yeah, they got that Batman car right there. Okay. Well, look at that model from the back right there. That's the one that Kato had with the Green Land, with the Green Hornet. Really cool. And then they got this end cap right here so you can see it's just full you have a lot of digging to go in there all right so here they are i found them so they must have got more in so they sold out last time when i filmed them here when they first got them they were sold out and i got a feeling it was because of the video um, a lot of people were dming me about them too about these two and all those sold out especially that one and you see right here don't know who makes it either but there is the scan on there right there for it but yeah they got them in and then they got the larger rainbow bright and they got a smaller strawberry shortcake compared to the other one too so and it smells like strawberries that one all right so they have done nothing new over to the collector section look how lame this looks there's just nothing new here all right folks so just left walmart oh boy um yeah it is what it is but yeah i'm not a, i'm not big on walmart but i did score something there I have to wait to the end of the video to see it heading into target tracy california it's mother's day weekend uh say it again um to all you moms out there um happy mother's day all right let's head into target all right, so let's check out what they have. All right, quite the little selection. Yeah, all right. Oh, they got him back. He's the more bulkier one. He's cool. They got like three versions of it. And they got that version from last year. It's a hurricane coming down. <laughs> Remember Hurricane Helms, Shane Helms. Uh, yeah, but um, they have they had a version last year that had like two or three arms or something. That was pretty cool. 
Um, yeah, I, my wife ended up getting me uh, Vincent Price, so she knows I'm a huge fan of old uh, monster movies. So she got me that one. Um, yeah, that bunch of those two packs still left. So okay, so you got the one, the dude from Jaws. Let's see here. Oh, they got a brand new thing of a. Uh, look at this. Brand new one. So. Uh, yeah, not really. Nothing new. I know that these are these uh, Friday the Thirteenth ones. I know that these are uh, what do they call them? Um, like repaints. So, but I'm not going to spend all that money again just to have one that's slightly different in color. Um, but it's there for those that want to. So here's another end cap of some things they got going on here. So they got the other end cap right here of more turtle stuff. NECA you still got ripped off because look at this. This space has been empty since I can remember. It's like that at all stores. Just you guys got ripped off for like that rental space. All right, so here we go. We got some Star Wars Legos going on. And they got Droid the car. They got it right here. Got a few of them too. So looks like they have the same amount as that, that Walmart. We got some new Legos out there. Look at that. And they got some deals too. So for all you Lego fans, you might want to check out Target if you're in the area and this Walmart because they have large selections of Star Wars. And no, they do not have the Darth Vader head. You got to go to late to Lathrop, California, to get that one. So, and then you have some Harry Potter. We'll check that out. There you go. And then it looks like they put out another mailer of this. This is the second mailer that I found. Now they might have took all the Hogan chases out because they're exclusive only to target but uh, they do got that salt in so which is cool but i'm not gonna buy any of them last time i passed on that mailer that whole thing because uh it's just even though they had all the um what was it the chases i was the first one that got into it uh i think i might have been one of the first ones to find that mailer on youtube um but i left them but I was just curious just to see if there was another Hogan. No, it's all Captain Lou. And they got Shiki Baby right there. Muhammad Ali. Yeah, they got him. And then they also have that. Still sitting here. Um, just cases of it. I'm just wondering if it's on clearance. I might want to scan that thing. And they even got another one sitting right there. Because um, those are like the retros. And those some people are like would kill for that. And they're just sitting right here. So, yeah, see what they got. And then, yeah, look at that. They're starting to clear them up. So, Godzilla X Kong is getting ready to hit on Voodoo next week. So, well, this coming week. So, they're already doing pre-orders for it. So, could do that. And then they also have that. They have two of them. And if you've never seen what that thing can do, go down into my library down below. Check it out. Um, that thing is amazing. I mean, amazing. All right, so let's scan this thing. Nah, it's still 60 bucks. But they got a bunch of them though. Let's see what they got, look at that. Wow. So Star Wars has made its way to its own in cap, so they do have a few things. Over here, only a Target. So, yeah, this thing should have brought Anakin Skywalker in it. It should have, a young Anakin would have been proper for that one. Um, so, Alright, so they sold quite a bit of the McFarlane um, Demon Slayer figures. They're pretty much just about all gone. Last time they were fully stocked. Um, but then you also have this Gundam, yeah. Yeah, he's just a standard. Okay. So we'll go through really quick down this aisle. There's not really much here, folks. So just letting you know, I'll give you a little bird's eye view of it so you can check it out. They have that Batman right there. And then they have this guy. Looks like they have all him, just him, and that's it. 
So yeah, it's it's just wiped out, folks. Nothing here. Oh, and they got is that the Ben Affleck Batman up there? Pretty cool. All right, so Monster High. There you go, right here. Yeah, it's time for them to bring some new stuff out. They need some crossover characters. They need more of that. So. All right, so they got a lot of Pokemon here. You can see this. New battle packs. Just a lot going on. Look at this. And it's full. It's full, folks. They even got these tops cards. These box sets. More Pokemon sets. Okay, let's see here. Magic the Gathering. Well, yeah, Universe Beyond. A few others. Yu-Gi-Oh! Chops cards. Some new AEW cards. I saw some UFC ones all the way in the back toys. So, should have filmed them for you. More Magic cards. And that's what they got, folks. All right, folks. Sorry, right, a little. It's a little warm here in the valley. It's it's a hot day today, so it's probably our hottest day so far this year. But uh, just got home, so I'm a little sweaty. Um, you want to know what my pickups are? So there was one place that I did not film, and that was at Spencer's. Um, and I should have. I should have. I should have took out my phone because they had a lot of stuff. And anybody who's looking for. Um, the Chucky and Bride of Chucky, uh, the ones that they had at Spirit Halloween, along with Trick or Treat Sam and a few of the uh, little babies and all those other ones, and Glenn, Glenn who's hella hard to find, uh, Chucky's son, uh, they had them there at Spencer's, so they just got them all back because it's Halloween season's coming around, they're hooked up with, with Spirit Halloween, so check out your local Spencer's if you want li uh, somewhat life-size versions of those, uh, the ones that you would find at Spencer's. Uh, but anyway, I should have filmed there, uh, but that's not what I went to do. I went looking for a Terrifier 2 shirt from the second movie and still not in. Uh, but anyway, they did have something that I didn't have and I, I wanted to pick up. So I picked up the baby of Leatherface. So it's going to improve my Leatherface collection. So yes, I picked him up. He was 50 bucks, and I also picked up, let me see here, let me set this thing down. So, I also picked up this one, Demeter, The Last Voyage. So, I never got a chance to see this movie, so, um, yeah, I want to check it out. I don't know if it's good, but I'm big on horror, folks. So, if not, it's just going to go amongst thousands of other titles that I have here, so... But there was something that I did find. Uh, actually, my wife found it, and she had it in the cart. And I was like, whoa! She's like, we're getting it. Because I have all the other still books to this movie, except for this one. And I've seen them in other people's videos, but uh, I couldn't find it. But I ended up getting one, and she knew that I was after it. So she got me the steel book of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Uh, I have an all-gold steel book of this. That I purchased uh, decades ago, I believe. And um, yeah, I've been having it since. And I got another one too. And there might be a few more in. But I got a lot of versions of this particular movie. But I didn't have this cover art. Because I do have a theater poster of this. Uh, so it's going to look really good. But anyway, folks. Um, yeah, I picked that one up. And that was from Walmart. So like, comment, subscribe. And to all the moms out there. Happy Mother's Day. And from Mo's Toy Room Yours. Good night, everyone.